Good morning, students. So last class, so, uh, so discuss the topic uh, is uh, so what is the vectors? So what is the types of the vectors? Okay, types types of the vector. So now already discuss the topic is so what is the vectors and what is the scalars? What is the vectors and what is the scalars? So vectors having the both magnitude and direction and also satisfy the condition vector addition. Also satisfy the condition vector addition. And so what is the scalars? So scalars having only magnitude but no direction. Only magnitude but no direction. So is called as a scalars. And so what is the tangents? And the magnitude different magnitude and different direction is called as a tensors and uh, so types of the vectors also discuss the topic so there is the positive vectors and uh, so what is the negative vectors zero vectors null vector okay and uh, so position vector unity vector so etc so last plus row discussion now today the discuss uh, topic is Parallelogram. Okay. Today discuss the topic is parallelogram. So now the statement of the parallelogram. Now the statement of the parallelogram. So now see the diagram first of all. So P a vector and Q be the vector. Okay. Let consider P and Q. P is a vector. Okay. And Q also vector both have the same magnitude and same direction okay is urgent side of the is urgent side of the parallelogram and so passing urgent side of the parallelogram to be a point o p vector and q vector these two vectors both having the same magnitude and direction okay and at the point o okay so the resultant vector or be the or be the resultant vector then there or be the resultant vector or be the resultant vector and also passing through the same point okay then there or be the resultant vector okay resultant vector and passing through the same point okay passing through the same point he is called as a parallelogram Okay, so now one, now one second repeat. So what is the parallelogram? So parallelogram and so now consider the two vectors P vector and Q vector. Okay, P vector and Q vector. These two vectors having the same magnitude and the same direction passing through the single point or same point. Then the resultant vector is also gives the resultant vector is also gives the magnitude and direction passing through the same point. Resultant vector is gives a magnitude and direction passing through the same point. Okay, and P and Q are some side of the parallelogram. Okay. P and Q both have the same magnitude and the direction or inside of the parallelogram and passing through the same point. Okay, single point. Now also, then the resultant vector, resultant vector or gives a or gives a. So that is the direction and the magnitude, direction and the magnitude and the passing through the same point. So now in this diagram so o a b c is a parallelogram okay is a parallelogram o a b c is a parallelogram and now is taken o b is the q vector o b is equal to q vector and o a is equal to p vector o a is equal to P vector and O C is equal to R vector. Okay, O C is equal to R vector and B O A is equal to angle B O A is equal to theta. Okay, and angle 
C and B O A is equal to theta and C A D is equal and C A D also theta. Now C O A is equal and C O A is equal taken alpha. Okay, clear that. And so O A B the vector and it is represented by P. And so similar like that O B is a Q vector. Okay, Q vector represented by Q and O C is a vector represented by R. And so the angle B O A is equal to angle C A D that is theta. Okay, clear that. And so now once again. The angle B O A and C A D is equal to theta, and C O A is equal to alpha angle. Okay, and O A is equal to P, and similar here also like P, and O B is equal to P. That is O B is equal to Q. Here also A C is equal to Q. Okay, so from triangle is taken C O D. Triangle is taken C O D. Okay, so triangle taken C O D. C O D. O C square is equal. O C square is equal. O D square plus C D square. O D square plus C D square. Okay, clear sir. O D square plus C D square. So O C square is equal. O D square. Okay, O D square is nothing but we have taken O D square is equal O A plus A D. O A plus A D. That is O D. Okay, O A plus A D O D square plus C D square. C D square. Now, in a simple. In taken O D is equal O A plus A D. O D is equal O A plus A D. According to okay, according to A plus B all all square formula by using it is O A square plus A D square plus two O A A D A D plus C D square C D square. O A square plus A D square two dot O A dot A D plus C D square. Now to find out the A D square and C D square. A D square is taken A B square and C D square. So by using the triangle, so taken triangle, so triangle that is the C A D triangle. C A D is also triangle. So now extend this positions. Okay, clear that. And so by using the sin theta, so sin theta is equal. Okay, sin theta is equal. So opposite side by hypotenuse. Opposite side is nothing but C D by A C A C. So C D is equal A C sin theta. Okay, this is sin theta. A C is equal is taken Q. So Q sin theta. C D is equal Q sin. Theta. Okay. And so similar from the same triangle is taken C A D and by using the cos theta formula. So cos theta is equal adjacent side by hypotenuse. So adjacent side is taken A D. So A D by A C. Okay. A D by A C. So A D is equal. Okay. A C cos theta. Okay, A D is equal to A C. A C is taken Q. A C is equal Q. So now substitute Q cos theta. Okay, so equation one and equation two and equation three. Okay, equation one, equation two, equation three. Equation two and three substituting in equation one. So equation two and three. Substituting in equation one. Okay, clear that. So now O C square. So O C square is equal. So O C square is equal. So O C already we know that. So O C we can write the R. Okay, R vector. R vector that is equal O Y square. So O Y already we know that. That is a P square. 
ओके पी स्क्वेयर ए डी स्क्वेयर प्लस सी डी स्क्वेयर ओके ए डी स्क्वेयर प्लस सी डी स्क्वेयर so now here see that a d square and c d square a d square is equal a d is equal q cos theta and c d is equal q sin theta a d is equal q cos theta a d is equal q sin theta a d square plus c d square is equal that is means q square sin square theta plus q square cos square theta so q square sin square theta plus q square cos square theta so q square common taken sin square theta plus cos square theta so that is equal to 1 okay sin square theta plus cos cos square is equal to 1 so now this equation so substitute in equation so o s square is equal p square a d square plus c d square is equal to q square okay clear that i know 2 2 o a is p AD is nothing but AD already to find out Q cos theta, okay? Q cos theta. Now, so here taken R is equal R square is equal R square is equal P square Q square two P Q cos theta, and R is equal under root of P square plus Q square two P Q cos theta, okay? So this is resultant vector magnitude of the resultant vector. So R is equal under root of p square plus q square to p q cos theta. Okay, clear that. So now we have to take it. So O A square O A is equal p square and A D square C D square is equal q square. Also substituting and to p q cos theta. Okay. So these are resultant vector. So now one second repeat. So these are two vectors are adjacent side of the vectors parallel to each other. Adjacent side of the parallel to each other. I know. So having the same magnitude and same direction and passing through the single point, then the resultant vector is also gives the resultant of the magnitude and direction and also passing through the same point. So the arrangement is total parallel to each other. So parallel to each other. O B is equal. So O B is equal Q. O A is equal P and O C is equal taken R. Okay. So the angle. So the angle B O is equal C A B is equal theta. Okay. But according to uh, so the triangle C O D O C square is equal. So O C square is equal O D square plus C D square. So O D square is equal O A plus A D. Okay now. So O D square is equal O A plus A D. And substituting the equation. And by using the so a plus b all square formula, so o a square plus c d square two o a a d and c d square. And the simplification, we get the resultant or is equal under root of p square plus q square two p q cos theta. Okay. Now the direction is also find out. So direction. So the direction is making alpha. Okay. The that that is nothing but o. C is making alpha with x-axis or with p vector. Okay, O C is making some angle alpha with O A or with p vector. P vector. So that is what is a tan alpha is taken. Okay, I know. So the triangle is taken. The triangle is O C D triangle. O C D triangle. So the tan alpha is equal. Tan alpha is equal opposite side by adjacent side. So opposite side is taken. That is equal C D by C D by O D. Okay, O D. And so the tan alpha is equal C D by O A plus A D. Tan alpha is equal C D. So C D by already we know that. So C D is taken. That is called as a Q cos theta. Q cos theta by O A is nothing but P and A D is equal. A D is equal Q cos theta. Q sine theta. Okay. So and alpha is equal tan inverse Q cos theta by P plus Q sine theta. Okay. This is called as a okay. This is called as a direction. Okay. So the resultant vector alpha making angle alpha with the O A or P vector. 
and so the uh, prime triangle taken OCD tan alpha is equal opposite side by arjun side okay opposite side by arjun side so opposite side by arjun side so arjun side CD is equal OA plus AD so OA OA is equal already to find out the in uh, before equation so the OA is equal to P AD is equal to Q sin theta so alpha is gives a direction so the direction making alpha with the AP vector okay clear that very very important four marks question in IPE okay so now discuss the another topic is so now small problem okay so small problem that is p plus q is equal to p minus q okay p plus q is equal to p minus q and now prove that okay prove that the angle between the angle between is 90 degrees okay 90 degrees if p is equal to, okay if p plus q is equal to p minus q okay these are vectors p plus q is equal to p minus q and prove that the angle between the angle between is 90 degrees okay got it so now by using the p plus q okay p plus q is equal to okay so squaring on both sides so squaring on both sides so under root of p square plus q square plus 2pq cos theta okay 2pq cos theta okay under root so now similar pattern under root of p minus q whole square is equal p square plus q square minus 2pq cos theta okay but uh, given information or given condition so p plus q is equal to p minus q and uh, substituting of these two equations so, so p square plus q square plus 2pq cos theta is equal and uh, so p square minus plus q square minus 2pq cos theta okay now so there is two roots are cancelled to each other and p square p square also cancel q square q square also cancel so remaining equation 2pq cos theta okay so minus 2p cos theta it is uh, uh, so plus 2pq cos theta is equal to 0 okay 4pq cos theta is equal to 0 so cos theta is equal to 0 by something also 0 so 0 so the theta is taken 19 degrees hence to prove it okay we have that so now we have taken p plus q is the vector p minus q and prove that the angle between e is 90 degrees okay and p plus q now the squaring on both sides okay squaring under root both sides is taken so p square plus q square 2 p cos theta p square plus q square minus 2 p cos theta the according to the condition okay according to condition so p plus q is equal to p minus q is taken so root root are cancel p square p square cancel q square q square, q square cancel and 2 p q cos theta so 2 p q cos theta is equal 0 4 p q cos theta is equal 0 and cos theta is equal 0 by something also 0 but 4 p q is not 0 okay theta is equal 90 degrees cos theta is equal 0 theta is equal 90 degrees hence prove it the angle between a is 90 degrees okay so thank you friend and so tomorrow uh, next day uh, so now uh, prove that or show that the trajectory of the object is parabola okay na? so that trajectory of object any object is parabola okay and so what is the trajectory okay what is the projection okay so what is the time time of the flat okay so some definitions are discussed on next period okay thank you